Hello everyone. Let's deal with this problem very quickly. We have square root of x plus x equals 35 over 4. Okay, so how do we deal with this? The first thing is to move x to the other side. So we have square root of x to be equal to 35 over 4 minus x okay then the next thing is to square both sides and the whole of this will be squared this will cancel this so that x will be equal to 35 over 4 minus x in two places 35 over 4 minus x now let us open the bracket x will be equal to 35 over 4 times 35 over 4 that will give us 1225 over 16 that is 35 times 35 will give this 4 times 4 will give this then minus 35 over 4 times minus x will give us 35x over 4 then Minus x times 35 over 4 will give us minus 35 x over 4. Then we have plus x um, squared. Okay, now let's continue. We have x to be equal to 120, okay, 1225 over 16. Minus, here the LCM is 4. And I have to put these two together so I get um, 70x then plus x uh, squared. This is now a quadratic equation and we can deal with it by you know getting the LCM. The LCM of this is 16. So 16 times x will give 16x minus 16 will cancel itself from here. Okay, this is equal to we have 1, 2, 2, 5. Then minus 16 divided by 4 is, is 4. 4 times 70 will give us 280x. Then plus 16 times this will have um, 16x uh, squared. Now let's continue. Let's arrange it properly now. So we're going to have 16x squared then this is minus 280x and then this will come here to become minus 16x okay then this is plus plus um 1 2 2 5 and the whole of this will be equal to 0 okay so these are big numbers they are big numbers but then it's still simple to deal with now from here let's put this together right so that we'll have 16 x squared then minus 6 0 that will be 6 1 this will be 9 then um, we have 2 over here so we have 296 x but negative then plus 1 1 2 okay 1 2 2 5 then everything is equal to zero right okay so now let's think of the method to use okay so let's solve this using the formula method a will be 16 b will be minus 296 and c is 1 2 2 5 okay now the next thing we're going to do is to get the formula x is equal to minus b positive or negative square root of b squared minus 4ac and the whole of this will be over 2a okay now let's pick it let's pick it up from here now i will substitute everything into the equation okay so i've imputed abc into the formula now so in place of b i'm having 296 negative will cancel the negative there 
then um, b squared is minus 296 squared then minus 4 point okay, that is 4 times 16 times 1 2 2 5 because we're multiplying okay everything will be over 2 times 16 now what we have under the square root i'm going to get it right away okay so this is what we have 296 plus or minus we have square root of um, 9216 that is minus um minus 296 squared okay once you square it and then you take it um you take four times um a was um 16 right okay then multiply by c and our c was one two two five so once you make your subtract um, subtraction you got um you will get two nine two one six over 32 now let's continue this is interesting x will be equal to two nine six plus or minus square root of um nine two one six is ninety six then we have this over 32 right okay now let's continue this means that x is equal to 296 plus 96 over 32 or 296 minus 96 over 32 now let's continue our x will now be equal to if you add this up you will have 3 392 okay over 32 or on this side you're going to have 200 over 32 yeah so what we'll do now is trying to reduce this the lower term or divide it completely okay so x will be equal to 8 can go into both of them, okay, so 8 into this will give us 49, 8 into 32 will give us 4, right, or on this side, 8 into 200 will give us 25, and 8 into 32 will give us 4, okay, so this is what we have as the value of x, so our x1 now is 49 over 4, and then x2 is 25 over 4 but then I will correct in our calculation let's get back to the original equation where we got square root of x plus x to be equal to 35 over 4 right now what I will do now is to put in the value of x so that means I'm going to have 49 over 4 plus 49 over 4 but remember this is under the square root sign now if I continue with this will it give me 35 over 4 this is square root of 49 is 7 square root of 4 of 4 is 2 then plus 49 over over 4 now let's add this up very quickly the LCM is going to be 4, then LCM, which is 4, divided by 2 is 2, times 7 is 14, then plus 4 divided by 4 is 1, times 49, that will give 49. And at the end of the day, if you put this together, 4 and 9 will give 3, this will give 5, plus 1, 63, over 4. And 63 over 4 is not the same thing as 35 over 4 meaning that this value of x which is x1 does not satisfy the original equation okay now let's go straight to the second solution x2 and then i'll put it in the square root we'll get 25 over 4 then plus 25 over 4 the question is will this give us 35 over 4 now this is um, square root of 25 is 5, square root of 4 is 2, then plus 25 over 4. The LCM, the LCM is 4, right? Then 4 divided by 2 is um, 2 times 5 is 10, plus 
4 divided by 4 is 1 times 25 is 25. And then when you add this, you have 35 over 4. And this is what we got on the right hand side. Okay, so this is to say that x2, which is equal to 25 over 4, okay, satisfies the given equation. Thank you for watching.